everybody, I'm Natalia Bonner. It's day 121. Today I'm going to be stitching using my trailer machine quilting ruler. You can pick up my ruler, threads, and all those yummy notions over on my website, peaceandquilt.com. But in the meantime, let's get stitching. I'll start out by using my blue Mark Beyond marker and marking a T through the center of my block. Once I've done that, I'm going to measure out from the center and mark a square that is one inch out from the center on all four sides. Now it's time to start stitching. Beginning in the upper left corner of the block, I'm going to stitch back and forth vertical straight lines every half inch. Using just the markings on my inside out ruler, I'll stitch my first line, travel along the ditch until my first marked line on my machine quilting ruler is on top of my thread. I'll repeat this process moving back and forth until I've filled in that top section completely. From there, I'll move down to the bottom left section. Now I'm going to rotate and stitch the same lines, half inch spacing. This time though, they're going to go horizontal. So I'll repeat that process, filling in that lower left corner of the block with half inch spaced horizontal lines. I'm going to repeat this process on the remaining two squares, the lower left corner and the upper, or the lower right corner and the lower, or upper right corner, alternating direction on both of those squares. Once I've done that, I'll stitch around, work my way back to the center, stitch around that center block that I've left open, now you can leave this block open or you can always add a fun filler in there. This is a great place for like a fussy cut element, something like that on a block. I'll finish off the design by stitching in the ditch all the way around the block. I hope you enjoyed today's block and found a little bit of inspiration with my machine quilting. Now just remember, you can pick up the panel, the rulers, the thread, all of the notions that I'm using in this video today over on my website, peaceandquilt.com. And don't forget to share your progress pictures over on Instagram using the hashtag Let's Stitch with Natalia. That's where we will be selecting winners for weekly prizes. See you all tomorrow. Thank you.